Hello everybody, this is Evan Rogers, coming at you with Evan's Easy Japanese JLPT N5 Listening. These ones are so short, these are great for me because it requires less editing and less talking and less you guys looking at my bald head. It's wonderful. Consider liking and subscribing and sharing this all over social media. Maybe even donate with all the links in the doobly-doo that you can link to give me some encouragement because this takes a lot of time, even though these are short. All that out of the way. Let's go ahead and truck on through. Listen to what they have to say. See if you know what the answer is. We want to know what... Oops, I should probably close this. We want to know what Yajirushi no Hito, the person with the arrow, is saying at some point. Uh, they're going to explain it in the listening and then we are supposed to figure out which one of the three answers is the correct one. Or at least the most apt. That's a fun word to say. A-P-T. Did something just fly? I think a spider just fell from the sky onto my microphone. That was weird. All right. Here we go. Apt. どんなチョコレートですか Okay, so far every single answer has been, oh, uh, hit the pause button or jump forward 15 seconds. Maybe listen to that before I give the answer. Here I go, here's the answer. Every single answer so far has been number three. I don't, um... It's getting a little bit worrisome. I guess they're just trying to trick you. It's like three, 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 three. Then the last one's going to be one. Uh, so the lady said um, you're going to give or the person with the arrow is going to give her friend some um, some chocolate. What does she say? Here is the script. Um, there we go. Tomorachi ni chocolate wo agemasu. The verb is agemasu. That's a good one to know. We already know the subject. The subject is person with arrow. Uh, which was the lady giving it. So, agemas is to give. The person to whom you give is the ni particle. So, give to your friend. Um, I want to point out um, that while agema, the ni particle in an agema sentence means give to somebody, uh, the opposite of agemas, well, not the opposite, but basically the opposite of agemas is moraimas, which is to receive. Now, this, if we have a moraimasu here, moraimasu, if we use moraimasu here, the ni particle switches it to from whom you received it. So, for example, this is tomodachi ni chocoreto is chocolate, and that's the O particle. That's what we're giving. Hopefully, you can figure that out by now. If you can't watch the other videos, you'll learn what the O particle does. Tomodachi ni chocoreto o agemas is to give chocolate to your friend. If we switch agemas to moraimas, it would be tomodachi ni chocoreto o moraimas, which would be I will receive chocolate from my friend. Ni is the other person. Okay, that's kind of a joke that has innuendos. We've seen the sense in every single one of these nanto imasuka, two translations, what are they saying? Um, or to how uh, uh, how do you say something in a in a different language? Uh, here it means what 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 do they say? What will they say? Notice how it's emos. It's not complete, so it it will happen either in the future or it's happening con uh, repeatedly. Number one, donna chocolate chocolate desu ka? Donna chocolate desu ka? Donna? What kind of? Notice the na at the end uh, that goes directly into a noun, chocolate. So what kind of chocolate desu ka is it? Um, if you're going <laughs> to imagine your friend is giving you chocolate and they're like, what kind of chocolate is it? It's like, ah, I don't know. Why are you giving it to me? <laughs> I have a peanut allergy for God's sakes. Chocolate, agemasen ka? Won't you give me? <laughs> Won't you give somebody some chocolate? Um, that's not what you want to say. Uh, really, this is interesting. Notice there's no particle. Um... Nouns don't need to have a particle after them. Uh, in fact, sometimes it would be less than the best solution, or less than the best uh, thing to do. Here, um, we already know 
we are um, giving chocolate, so we don't really need to specify an O particle. The O particle will put emphasis on the thing that you're giving, like, what did he give them? He gave them chocolate. That's what the O particle does. And we don't need it here. Chocolate, agemasen ka? This is the wrong answer. Um, when you hand somebody chocolate, you don't say, won't you give somebody chocolate? Um, if you're giving it to your friend, you don't tell your friend to then give it to somebody else. Uh, number three, chocolate, ikaga desu ka? Okay, so chocolate. This chocolate, the particle that's not being mentioned would be a wa particle. So a chocolate wa, if, if there were a particle here, would have been wa. For this one, number two, it would have been an o, uh, which is intriguing because you're probably not at the stage where you can judge which particle to leave out and which it replaces. Anyway, chocolate wa, ikaga desu ka? Ikaga means how about? How do you feel? Um, how, 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 how? I mean, how, how? Ikaga, how about? How about might be the best transition. How about some chocolate? Um, the desk here is largely just being polite. Um, it doesn't actually really, it doesn't mean is really. Um, it's, it's just sort of polite. Um, so, chocolate, ikaga desu ka? How is some chocolate? How It means how about some chocolate? The more I think about it, that sentence in English doesn't have a verb either. How about some chocolate? Hmm. There's no there's there's no uh, verb in the sentence. How about some chocolate? Even in uh, even in English. So here, similarly, this desk doesn't translate to the English is at all. Um. Okay. So I'll read these um all of this so that you can kind of hear a more American accent. Here we go. Tomodachi ni chocolate wo agemasu. Nan to imasuka? Oh, sorry. Uh, nan to imasuka? Nan to imasuka? Number one. Donna chocolate desu ka? Number two. Chocolate agemasen ka? Number three. Chocolate ikaga desu ka? All right, good. Let's listen to the actual Japanese person speak it. Let's see if I can guess where the beginning is. Oh, hey, cool. Niban. Tomodachi ni. チョコレートをあげます。なんと言いますか? There you go. That's it. These are really short. Hope you had a good time. Uh, see you next time. It'll probably be tomorrow. Consider a donation. Like, subscribe, share on social media. Tell all your friends about me. And I will tell you to have a great day. Peace out.